this important message from the Fire Marshal's Public Fire Safety Council, the Hawkins Janak Foundation for Carbon Monoxide Education, and Kidda Canada could save your family's life. Please watch. Carbon monoxide is called the silent killer. That's because you can't see it, taste it, or smell it. But I can. I can see it when I look at pictures of my niece and her family. I can taste it when I remember the dinners we used to share. And I can smell it when I pass the rink that her husband and kids used to skate on. My name is John Janak. That was me four years ago, after carbon monoxide killed my niece, Lori Hawkins, and her entire family. They did not have a carbon monoxide alarm. Fire departments respond to thousands of CO-related calls in Ontario every year. Too often, families are unprotected because they don't have a CO alarm, or the one they have is past its seven to 10 year lifespan. In 2008, uh, there was a tragic accident to my family in Woodstock. My niece, Lori, her husband, and both her children passed away from carbon monoxide poisoning. This is close to my heart because I promised my brother that I would do the very best I could so this wouldn't happen to another family in Ontario. So this is the only way I know how to do it, get the law passed and protect everybody in Ontario. We finally passed the Hawkinsgenic Act, which is mandatory carbon monoxide detectors in every home in the province of Ontario. Any dwelling at risk of carbon monoxide exposure now needs by law CO alarms installed near sleeping areas. This applies to all homes, no matter the age. If you have oil, propane or gas burning appliances, a furnace or water heater. You also need CO alarms for wood or gas fireplaces, other fuel burning appliances, or if you have an attached garage. CO exposure has the same symptoms as flu. Uh, you feel tired, listless, nausea, but you don't have the fever. If your alarm goes off and you or other occupants suffer from symptoms of CO poisoning, Immediately have everyone in the home move outdoors and then call 911 or your local emergency services number from outside the building. There's uh, three things that we recommend from the foundation to protect yourself from carbon monoxide. One, educate yourself about the dangers of carbon monoxide and how it will affect you. Number two, make sure that you get all your appliances checked by a qualified technician every year. And number three, put a CO alarm in your home because we know that carbon monoxide is colorless, odorless, and tasteless. It's the only way you'll ever know it's in your home. Ontario's new alarm law also stipulates that alarms be replaced within the time frame indicated in the manufacturer's instructions or on the label of the unit. That's why we need this law to make sure that our fire service can enforce that in every home in the province. Now I need you to do your part by installing a CO alarm today. Help me honor my family's memory and make sure your family is protected. Lori would want it that way. For more information and safety tips, go to endthesilence.ca.